Hi, this is Todd and today is August 26, 2018. Today we're going to talk about pairing monarchs. Um, there is a little bit of a concern that it's kind of late in the year and that emerged monarchs might be in a migration mode. Um, in my flight house I have about a dozen monarchs. And it's a little overcast right now so the monarchs are not flying a whole lot here in my flight house. I've got willows to serve as Somewhat shade trees. I have showy milkweed and I have nectar source. This is uh, Bodleia davidii that they are nectaring on, as well as Spirea that this female is nectaring on. Um, so the showy milkweed is not in here to get females to lay eggs until they mate, uh, but to entice the males to want to mate with females. And as you know, males generally are not ready to mate once they emerge close as adult butterflies. They take two or three days of activity and so um, the butterflies have been flying around and, and getting ready to either be set free to migrate or to see if they'll mate. And uh, after two days, two and a half days, we finally have our first pairing. Male and a female. So what I do, monarchs generally mate for 24 hours, is I have many pop-ups and I will, I don't have three hands, so I'll place the mating pair in this mini pop-up and put them in the dark and let them uh, finish um, copulation, which takes roughly 24 hours. Then I will re-release the male inside this flight house, where he'll again probably need several days before he's ready to mate. And then the female will be set up in a smaller pop-up with uh, showy milkweed to lay eggs. Okay, so we have um, successfully placed the mating pair so I can do this with two hands. Inside the mini pop-up. So what I'm going to do is take this and uh, give them a room as it, were, as it were, so that they're not harassed by other, other of the monarchs flying around, and then we'll set her up to lay eggs. Okay, we have now secured uh, the bottom of the catch and release uh, pop-up cage. Uh, to the five gallon bucket, secured it with um, with some string. So up here, I can now zip this shut and then place this next to a window. And then generally speaking, females are ready to lay eggs. Um, I give them an hour or two to see if they're laying. If they're not, I'll feed them and um, let them think about it for a day or so. They're not always ready to lay eggs right after having been mated. Um, but this female has been in captivity for a day or two as the males were getting ready to mate with her. So she may be ready to lay eggs immediately. So we'll see how we do.